Hi people, Pops here for your insight uh, today and uh, we're looking at one today. So today we are looking at the word mellifluous. So the word is an adjective and it's mostly used in relation to sound and it means pleasingly smooth and musical to hear. So you can talk of a voice or maybe sound made by something. So among the synonyms we have the word soothing or even harmonious and then uh, the direct opposite we have the word cacophonous. Right, so um, we said that mellifluous is used in reference to a sound when you're talking about something that is pleasant to hear. Examples of mellifluous in a sentence, so we can say we couldn't get enough of hello mellifluous voice. We couldn't just get enough, okay? Like you can't get enough of mine, okay? Uh, on a light note, though, okay. Uh, the second example we can say his voice was mellifluous and comforting. His voice was mellifluous and comforting. So let's look at the other, uh, the other side. So we say that the opposite of the word is uh, cacophonous, and this means involving or producing a harsh discordant mixture of sounds or simply having an unpleasant sound so it is the direct opposite or what we call the antonym of the word mellifluous and so an example in a sentence we can say i couldn't sleep last night and literally this is actually true it's not just an example i couldn't sleep last night because of the cacophonous honking of a car nearby so yeah I hope you've learned actually two words for the day. So we're looking at the word mellifluous, which means a pleasant sound to hear, and the direct opposite, which is cacophonous, which means a harsh voice. So until next time, I say it's bye for now.